Hey everyone, this is Adorable Yoshi3124 welcoming you back to Lunar 2 Eternal Blue Complete. And this time we're going through the Blue Spire now. We're on the second floor. So let's get started, shall we? And there's also four of these orbs. So we shall get all of them. Because that opens a path to the next floor. And will I have enough magic power? We shall see, because there's a few more of those eyeball character enemy things. Yes, eyeball character enemy things. <laughs> Alright. Oh, okay, this is not bad. There's only three. One more level, though, and Gwen can kill him in one hit. Maybe. That's if he doesn't die first. Only 3 XP! Those guys are only worth one experience apiece. Which is annoying. Alright. I'm gonna save those starlights. If you keep using them though, I think they cost a thousand each. So that's kinda risky if you use them a lot. Because those are expensive. Or is that five thousand? I'm not sure. Either one or five thousand. Okay, nope. I'm not gonna even worry about it because he'll kill him in one hit. Yep. I wonder how much uh, Gwen levels up. You don't have to worry about Gwen hitting level 11, but you might want to. Because he has something that's really good. You'll see why later. Uh, excuse me. Ah, oh, jeez. I don't have enough magic. Oh well, as long as I get that guy out. See, he has like 50 HP. That's why post sword helps. It helps a lot. <clears throat> is there another enemy over here? Yes, and it's the same guy. Hmm. Let's use this then. Because I don't want to die. Ow. Ow. Ah, oh, crap. Oops. Sorry, I didn't mean to say that. <laughs> Gwen's gonna die. Maybe. Yes, he did die. Kill him! Yes. I think he still gets the experience if you die. I think he did. There we go. I didn't want to die, so <laughs> if I'm not recording, I don't mind doing that, but in this case, yes, I am healing all the HP. Cut. Say if you only got three of the four orbs, you couldn't teleport up here. Alright.
hero when look at that isn't that fantastic and in this part I'm just gonna flee from all the enemies you'll see why late when I get up there so I'm not gonna waste time I've always done that anyway so waste time or not that's what I usually do Indeed it is, Ruby, indeed it is. After all these years of gazing at the blue spire from afar, I'm about to unlock its mysteries. You have to keep walking before you start unlocking, Grandpa. <laughs> yes. Alright, we'll continue up the spire. Like I said before, I'm going to flee from every battle, or try to. Go away! I do not want to fight you. Haha! Uh -huh. And I'll get that chest when I come back down. No! Oh! Fine, I'll fight you. We'll kill him? Yes. We shall get... I don't know, we'll see. But yeah, if you played the first game, you'll know that the uh, Null, uh, he revives. Not all the time though, but sometimes. Ah, jeez. I do not want to fight you. Me. Ah, man. You're dead, maybe. That's exactly the reason why I wanted Poe Sword. Because this would be a hard dungeon until I got it. That would make a great challenge though. But... I haven't practiced yet. I haven't done those types of challenges yet in this game. Jeez, he leveled up twice and Gwyn's still level 9. He should be close though. By two experience, I hate. There's some times when you'll, you're only one experience away. Don't you hate that? Ah, jeez, I hate those guys. I don't know if to do. Okay, we'll do that. Because that mask guy reduces your defense. And he's going after Grandpa. And I'm surprised no one's hitting him yet. And he also hits twice. So if he hit Grandpa, it would do 10 damage each or so. There we go. And he leveled up and got fractured armor. 
That'll help, actually. I'll be getting those chests later, so don't worry. Darn it. I'm gonna try to run. No, that didn't work. Shooty. Yes, ferocious wind. I can handle this guy alone. That's what I get for Trying to do it the hard way. No. Oh yeah. I'll get that. Since I'm right there. But I'll get those treasure chests on the way back down. So don't worry. This is the seventh floor of the spire. The ancient writings tell of a hidden passage to the top. And we must search this room thoroughly to find it, me boy. And I know where it's at. So, bye-bye, uh, Gwyn. Who, a hero? What is that? Let's go get Grandpa and show it to him. I bet he'll know. Hero? What's happening? Hero? Hero? Hero, I think we just found the secret passage to the top of the spire. You don't think the destroyer is around here, do you? I don't want to be eaten by a monster. Hee <laughs> hee. You worry too much, Ruby. And besides, I don't think either of us looks very tasty. Haha. <laughs> very funny, Hero.
Lucia, I have come from the blue star with an urgent mission. Your world is in grave danger. I must see Alfina immediately. Take me to her. Yes, she is, isn't she, hero? <laughs> hero? What's wrong with you? She's not even human. Here, let me tuck your tongue back into your mouth and wipe that throw off your chin. Wait, Lucy, you where are you going? I must find Althena and join with her so to fight so far. Althena, the goddess of our world, why do you need to find her? Who are you? I'm Hero, and this is Ruby. In the flesh. The two of you are residents of this world? You must guide me to Athena. It is urgent that I find her and speak with her. Are you nuts, lady? You just show up out of nowhere and expect a trip to the goddess? Here is an adventurer, not a tour guide, and no one knows where Athena is anyway. Ruby is right, but this girl obviously needs the help of a brave warrior like myself. I don't know if I can help you, Lucia, but I'm willing to try. <laughs> We'll see what, what Grandpa has to say about this hero. You must leave at once. What's happening? Bah! Oh, confound it all. Son, don't scare me like that. You had me beside myself. With worry, young man, I've been looking all over for you. Where in tarnation did you go? Oh dear, who's this you have found? Her name is Lucia. We found her at the top of the spire, inside a giant green crystal. And guess what, Grandpa? She says she's from the Blue Star. By Althena herself? She traveled here from the Blue Star? Hero, we have to get out of here right away. If Lord Leo discovers her here, we are in big trouble. And so is she. We'll talk later. Let's go. Yep. Before I end the video, I want to show you something. What is this? We are there. Why are there monsters within the blue spire? Don't worry, Lucia. I'll get rid of these fiends for you with a few swats of my sword. Are you sure? There's five of them. <laughs> so, in this case, we'll defend. Watch what she does. Do not interfere. Do not interfere. That's one reason why I'm going to be power leveled. By Lucia. Take this opportunity, because you'll see why later. Did you see that magic? Lucia, how were you able to cast such a powerful spell? I have no time for questions, hero. You must take me to the goddess Athena and quickly... Hey, wait up. Did I offend you? I'm sorry if I did, Lucia. Lucia! I don't think you offended her, me boy. I think she's just focused on finding the goddess. Hero? I don't think Lucia is human. Her magic is stronger than I've ever seen. Lord Leo could be right. She could be the destroyer. But why would she come here? 
She couldn't possibly be. She couldn't possibly be the destroyer, Grandpa. She's just a confused and beautiful girl. And she's going to leave us all behind in this fire unless we catch up to her. And that's what we're going to be doing. And her HP is pretty good, too, for a caster. That's probably level 99. Alright, guys. We will continue this in the next episode, where we exit the spire. Or will we? You'll have, just have to find out in the next episode of Lunar Eternal Complete. See you guys later.